They're
Hey, villain. How you doing? Thank you for the Hydra Redeem. I actually just took a sip. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to another Lulz Time stream. I do apologize for their tonight's tardiness. I was a little bit lazy, so we are running about, about uh, running a little bit behind. But I do have something special for you all this evening. Uh, this is going to be a blind run of this game because I've never played this before, and the last time I played a platinum game, get it, a platinum game, has been a hot minute. I'm expecting great things from it though. This is actually the precursor of a game series that one of my mods wanted me to play that kind of start, starts with a word that rhymes with pedal and ends with a word that rhymes with meerkats. That was a terrible joke. I don't know why I said that. I've been looking at this game for a while and I've had it in my library for a while. It's basically rule of cool the game, is my understanding. We'll get to check that out for ourselves. As soon as I remember um, some of the important tidbits like evidently how do I into changing the Oh, something's not right. Something's fucky. There's supposed to be an option here that allows me to change the audio source. Thank you for the resub, Steel. <laughs> the very part of this game is when Sam says it's vanquishing time and he vanquishes all the terrorists. Well, we will see how accurate your statement is in due time. First off, I need to figure out- Stop! Shit. I don't have my headphones on, so I didn't realize I was being attacked from all sides by garbage. <laughs> Love you too. All right, all right. Okay. When this stops, when these rewards stop redeeming, I'll be able to properly set. God damn it. Ah. Uh, there we go. Now that it's over, we can properly set the audio source, the audio sauce. Hopefully. There it is. Vanquish. Wow. Well, these are fairly good graphics for whenever a year this came out. 3,000 objects later. Uh, this is a port, right? A console port? I'm going into this game completely blind. I'm not going to even use controllers. I'm going to be using keyboard. Because I've not used keyboard in a video game in a long time. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of excited. It was originally a PS3 game? Damn. It would appear that we're starting on the Lost Colony Arc. We're gonna go... Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Well, that's fairly interesting already. I like the fact that when you... Change the different options here. It goes, spins along the axis of this uh, space civilization station. That's already pretty cool in my book. Ranking and options. It looks like it's already keyboard and mouse ready. The style holds up though. Platinum is good at that. The only other Platinum game I've played, I think, is... Uh, Automata, near Automata, and I didn't play it for that long, to be honest. I don't know why it didn't keep, keep my interest. Usually that sort, of, that sort of game would, but I know that's just something that is occurred. It was just didn't keep my interest at the time. We will... We will see to playing it later. What are comm messages? I'll keep it on because it sounds cool. Hey, Dokuro, how are you? How are you this evening? You good? That's good to hear. 
It's the coding messages? Oh, then we're keeping comm messages on. Just resting after playing some games and watching that man trailer. Did you see it? I did see the trailer of that man. I'm kind of disappointed that it was not another character because some people were saying, well, it might not be that man. It might be another man or another woman man, for that matter. But nope, it was that, in fact, that man. But that's alright. I'm sure he'll be fun to play when he comes out. But more importantly, I would like to hope that Arxis would have completed the uh, the maintenance fixes of the inter of the uh, game itself, of the um, network netcode itself. He looks like Nine the Phantom. I don't know who Nine the Phantom is, unfortunately. Also, why is it that I can't change the difficulty in controller type? Bruh. Is the game just that difficult? Very well. Vanquish. New game. We're gonna play this on hard because I hate myself. Vanquish. Vanquish. There are no options, no graphics op options, I just realized. Oh my god, we get to play as Sam from Metal Mirror Gear Solid. His, his fucking voice is great. You can tell that this is a product of its time. Yeah, I hope it works too, or we're gonna have a problem. Alright, so it's an FPS then? Uh, let me adjust my sensitivity a bit. I'm getting some Halo vibes right now. It's been a while since I played an FPS. You know, this is a real pain in the ass. How many times you guys gonna make me do this? It's important we have baselines, Gideon. Just because you can read a manual doesn't mean you know what you're doing. Now uh, this seems pretty basic as far as FPS games go. Tactical Evade? Huh. Previous weapon. Activate bomb. Skip events. Alright. Seems pretty straightforward for first person shooters of the era. A third person shooter, huh? Oh, yeah. We're getting full control, chat. So. Movement, I guess, sir. Oh uh, yeah, I'll give you a rotational movement. So spacebar is not jumping; it is dodge rolling. Okay. Getting some gears of war action here. In order to jump over stuff, you have to... okay. Skeletal actuators functioning nominally. We're going to get readings on booster... Boost limitation. Engage whenever you want. Move using the boost function of the R suit? Oh! Oh my god! Uh, this is the cream of the crop. This is the game, what the game is known for. The fucking power sliding all over this. It's unlimited too, you don't- oh wait, never mind. That's maximum practical output on, our current reactor design. on your current reactor design? So, it does improve. I can't just hold. <laughs> My God. I like the fact that you can just hold this space bar and do this everywhere. Did I win? 
This is the Gears of War era chest high walls game. Of course, there's no jump. My god. We really have gone back in the past. Launching virtual target. Io? Is there auto aim in this game? Is that what we're working with? We're going to adjust target acquisition. I'll acquire your target. How about them apples? Wait, why do you want me to try again? What the fuck? Oh, okay. So you want me to ADS this shit? I see how it is. I like how over the top his body armor is. It's like a combination of uh, Dead Space meets Halos. Recoil compensators are on and functioning normally. You can't suppress the recoil anymore. Sam, your weapon isn't exactly stock. I know. I'm changing blade modes. Let's try firing something different. I'll change your blade mode. Are you? Ooh, is this a DMR? Or just a standard assault rifle? This must be the shotgun. Yep. A scanner? What the fuck? This launcher. Oh. This is giving me some, uh... Kind of reminds me of the Cerebral Boar from Turok. A rocket launcher. An upgradable item. Hmm. Packing up the same weapon when carrying the maximum amount of ammunition will allow you to proceed. There are different upgrade paths for each gun. Io. Picking up surface scratches. Blade can only replicate what already exists, even the imperfections. Now we're going to check the grenade mounts. <laughs> oh my God! He does a freaking pitcher run to do that. Geronimo! I love the animation for him just freaking yeeting the grenade. Yeet. It means there's a lot of active frames, but you know what? What we lose in speed, we gain in sheer animation quality. Usually you just see... Usually when there's a grenade animation in the game, it's just a really simple, you know, flick of the wrist. They don't really think to get- they don't really think to... Okay, that one was a lot more... ...basic, I suppose. Close quarters combat. I'll test your impact force, baby. So this takes place in the real world, then. Given that there's a Pentagon and the Marines. Confirming electromagnetic reaction. Sam, give the electromagnetic engine generating the reaction force a second to cool. So we can't hit the thing too quick, huh? Go ahead and punch it again. Nothing beats the old one two. Uh, Looks like you've still got some bite in you, Sam. I'll give you a one two. Oh, what the shit? So I guess... Oh, it even says DARPA on his armor. What the hell? Each melee attack depends on your currently equipped weapon. Oh, that's cool. Let's see AR mode. We took the measurements we made of your brain's sympathetic nervous system and tuned the R's suit synaptic emitters to augment your reactions under fire. Are you? Really make walking around with electrodes all day any more comfortable. 
So he has no CBI. He has electrodes in his brain, in his on his head. Pog. I love the dialogue in this game. So an important part of this game, upgrading a gun upgrades every version you pick up for the rest of the game. However, if you even if even one bullet is missing, you won't get experience for picking up duplicates. What? So you want to leave duplicates on the ground until you can pick up a bunch at once to min-max upgrades. Really? That's a kind of sussy game design, but okay, thanks for putting pointing it out to me. I think I'll understand that when it becomes ro when we have to. Oh, fucking shit! Really? Oh, okay. So I'm supposed to dodge. I'm fucking dumb. I finished implementing the manual trigger system you asked for. The system will automatically lock if it detects any life-threatening imbalances in your hormonal levels due to extended use. I'll show you an imbalance in my hormonal levels. Missing in the one you're holding, a nearly empty one on the ground still gives you XP if the one you're holding is full. Okay. So basically, don't pick up any duplicate guns on the ground unless the one the gun you're holding is full of ammo. Oh, I got a uh, achievement for finishing the tutorial. Very well. I think that's enough for today's test. Good job, Sam. That little workout made me hungry. Elena, you up for some luckies? I'm up for some luckies. Or getting lucky, I should say. These are fairly good graphics for back then, I would say. Platinum Games. Director Shinji Mikami. The Golden Gate Bridge. Producer Atsushi Inaba. Art director Naoki Katakai. Katakai? Yep, this looks like a typical American town, chat. This looks like California. Those are certainly noises that are being played. It looks like an ICBM? No. A uh, underground satellite dish? No. Oh my god. I was half right. It's actually a satellite. Say goodbye to California? Is it Friday in California already? Are those spaceships? Is that a particle accelerator? Holy shit. They're gonna nuke San Francisco. Why couldn't they at least target Los Angeles instead? The hell did San Francisco do to them? Oh yeah, they're dead. You know, it sure took a while for that shockwave to hit the rest of the populace, didn't it? Oh! Ah, oh, shit, that was a very graphic de depiction of the guy's hand. Uh, what the fuck is going on here? Bruh. What? 
What the fuck is happening? I did not sign up to see California get nuked into the ground, but you know, uh... Hmm. Always feels like the Golden Gate Bridge has to get destroyed in one of these things. Is that a lone survivor we got going on here? Oh my god. The enemies are the Russians. Man, Putin's seen better days. Bitch, you want us to fire nukes at you again? My fellow Americans, today has been a day of great tragedy. San Francisco will never be the same. Yeah, well, no shit. The of our war has increased by countless men, women, and children. Their loss is deeply felt by every American. To those who have committed this heinous act, we say firmly. We will not negotiate with those who wish to destroy They got like space warfare in this? Our will when does this game even take place? I thought it was like present day for a moment there. Or slightly a little bit in the future, but it clearly isn't. This is some real Gears of War shit. Oh my god, he's actually named Sam! <laughs> I thought that was just a joke! This is straight up just freaking... No shit. Okay, so it's a micro. It's a giant microwave gun. So basically, what they did was they superheated San Francisco. Okay, fair enough. She's cute. Why does she have a Russian name? Yeah, Lena's great. Hell, even this suit runs on his energy designs. He's too valuable to kill. I know. I really like her design. Holy shit, she's cute. The toy you've been working on? <laughs> I also like how this old guy here. Some in this, thing. this old guy here, he kind of reminds me of him. I forgot the name of it. It said uh one super it said one uh, si one superhero who his whole shindig is he has a big he had this big cybernetic arm or something. They were so using that space station make burrito so hot that God couldn't eat it. Wait, what the fuck is happening? Why are they fighting and shit? What the fuck, man? smoke on the ship <laughs> I like the style 
of the the style of this uh, storytelling. It's very brash, very in your face, very like immediate. I've heard in the past. I've heard that this game is pretty much like the developers were just all, we're going to just make this game as obnoxious as possible in a good way, and they sure delivered. It feels like. I wasn't expecting the fucking spaceships though. What the f bruh? I wasn't expecting the spaceships though, for real. I wasn't expecting this game to take place in a freaking... To take place in an air where they already had space travel and stuff. Do my best here, Elena. I love the uh, spaceship design they got going on here too. Uh, like the Russian ships look kind of alienish, sort of like from across or something. While the human ships remind me strongly of uh, a slightly more exaggerated Halo design. I like that the uh, spaceships of the both forces are roughly the same technological level. It seems like. Oh yeah. Go, go, go! Are they doing ramming speed? Oh no, they're just gonna shoot their way through. Oh yes! Oh man, I am so hard right now. I have not played a game with good spa with spaceships and shit in a long time. I miss it so much. Oh my god. I didn't realize this game had spaceships and stuff in it. Bro, those don't look like humans at all. They look like the fucking Covenant. What the hell is this? I can't believe we're fighting the Covenant boys. This is just Halo. This is just like the anime version of Halo. Space Marines, let's move. What the hell's going on down here? Man! Get on board, sir. We're ready for wheels up. Hoorah! Hoorah, hoorah! This is- this game is such a product of its time. Do you want to live forever? <laughs> Starship Troopers! Stop fucking Starship Troopers reference! Oh my god, Sega. You guys are too much. <laughs> This game is so over the top, what the fuck? <laughs> it's only a few minutes. <laughs> is this really what the Japanese think of us Americans? Or at least back then? That's what I call a crash landing. Captain Keys would be proud. Oh my god. <laughs> this this cutscene is still going on up to now. <laughs> this is MGR if Sam joined DARPA instead of Desperado. <laughs> Motherfucker! We aren't gonna get through it like this, sir. Yeah. If you go there, you should be able to flank the enemy. Laser cannon? 
what which which one of these guns do I replace? Uh anti armor pistol, uh it's heavy machine gun, assault rifle, shotgun. Give me the laser give me the fucking laser cannon. Uh boost what the hell's a boost machine gun? Anti armor pistol Machine heavy machine gun assault rifle. I don't I don't know. Um I uh, Am I dying? I'm already dying. We're only a few. We're not even that far into the game already, chat. A game yet, chat. This is a dumb gun. Isn't this just a shotgun? Wait, where's the assault rifle? Shotgun. Laser cannon. Where's the fucking. Okay. Okay, uh, boost MG is burst for hung, hung Jesus, what a intro. I know, right? Welcome to the stream, Hungriest Clone. Uh, looks like there's a, there's health pickups over there or something. And I should probably bring a pistol, right? Um, uh, it's because it's an armor piercing pistol, right? So that's probably gonna be my, uh, sniper rifle type thing. Oh. Um, I'm already dying, chat. I don't know. I'm. I can. Uh, I'm supposed to. Is there a thing? Are there enemies here I can shoot? Am I supposed to shoot the uh, turrets or something or what? Oh, I see. Also, I just realized my laser gun does not have any ammunition. Well, that's just fine. Boost MG is burst fire? No, it doesn't seem like it's burst fire. Our dropships are just fucking falling out of the sky like crazy. Uh. Okay, can you guy can you please stop? Yes, thank you. Uh, laser can- oh, oh, the laser cannon works now. <laughs> I see, it uses the, uh, energy for your suit to fire. I understand now. Laser gun uses your energy, the same you use for sliding and time stop? Okay. I think, did we kill all the NPCs that are out guarding the front? No, there's one left? There, okay. I think we've cleared... I think we've cleared the uh, main entrance, and we managed to heal all my full all my uh, soldiers. Yeah. Oh wait, nope. Guess we need to destroy those turrets, right? Yeah. Cool. Support friendly troops in the area. I'll do my best, but no promises. Um, I should probably relearn how to use the time stop function because I am clearly not doing it right. I just realized that there are more of our, uh, more of our spaceship friends that are coming in through the breach and steadily getting closer. That's kind of cool. I like the sense of scale in this game, too. Okay, so, uh... Managed to get there. Um... Where am I supposed to be going next? Am I supposed to go on this thing here? Or... It's... Oh... Shit, did I die? No? I'm still alive? No, another ship's coming down. That was probably my fault. Good. Move on 
Looks like most of us have managed to survive in the process, but... Wait, can't I just rip this off of its... Uh... Hmm. Okay, it's not gonna let me do that. Cool. Ooh, there's like a big baddie thing over there. Um... Heavy machine gun. Proceed to landing dock three. What the f wait, what the shit? That really just happened just now? <laughs> I do believe I just uh, ran up and kicked the shit out of that uh, robot thing. This game is such a mess, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, what's this? There's a, there's a collectible or something here, right? Um, how do I get to it? Assault rifle? Okay. How do I, how do I get to that? Do I have to like go around and shit, or? I guess I do have to go shoot it, I think? Why is it cursing at me? What was that? <laughs> I am very confused. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but it was sort of pleasant. This game is interesting. I don't know what I'm doing yet, but hopefully I'll get used to it. I did terribly, chat. The arrival plaza for landing bay three is up ahead. We got heavy fighting in the plaza. Bravo, move forward but maintain cover. Roger that. This kind of feels like an arcade game, or it's supposed to be an arcade game at one point. I.O. Oh, don't worry. It will take you about a third of the game before you understand the game. <laughs> I've also never played a game with a cutscene that long before. At least, and not in recent memory. Act 1, Mission 3, Giant. I'm also running out of ammunition for this gun. This is kind of problematic. Ayo? Wait, where? Who? Which? I can't tell which one of these guys is are is the bad guys and who's not. What the fuck? Um, how can I tell if I'm actually hurting this thing? Oh my god. Oh uh, shit, I think I died. <laughs> I just fucking explodes. Bruh. Y'all did not just make that pun in front of me. Overheating my ass, come on. I need my laser powers, come on. Kind of regretting switching to this from the heavy machine gun now. Not gonna lie. Armor piercing pistol, right? Um, it's not piercing much. 
It's not doing any damage, in fact. What the fuck? Oh, that's not the bad guy. You run out of ammunition so fast in this game. God damn. Were they smart enough to dodge from the dodge the bullet just now? Alright, sniper pistol is go, apparently. Alright, 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 I'll move back, I'll move back. What do you mean, temporal? Time paradox? Oh, 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 well, fuck. That's, that's just lovely. Why is not letting me... Oh, okay, so in, increase the firepower of the laser cannon. Okay. It is piercing. You kill the pilot in one shot. Killed. You're meant to swap out guns constantly and pick up tubes to refill your ammo XP. Okay. So you are supposed to be filling it or picking up dupes in this game then. Well, I was confused because I thought you were not supposed to be doing that. What? What is that? The fuck was that? I'm just supposed to fight through what now? Good. Let's go. I am very confused still. Can I pilot this mech walker thing? I can. <laughs> oh fuck, I just blew it up. This game is such a meme, I swear to god. I don't I don't I still don't understand what I'm doing. I think I just died. This is being careful not to pick up one, you're only missing a few bullets. Okay. Are there any other ways to get up top? It looks like you're just going to have to fight through this one. Bro, is that Megatron? What the shit? I also totally forgot that you can actually just dodge roll all over the fucking place and I'm dead again. That dude has a legit brain, unlike me. Maybe playing this on the hardest difficulty was a terrible idea. Shotgun. Thank you for the head pat. The gate's open now. Good. Let's go. Intensifies indeed. Out of the way. My rage is eternal. My memes cringe. Okay, I also have to ask, what in the world is the health where is the health bar in this game? I don't know. I don't know how close to death I am or anything like that. It looks like you're just going to have to fight Heavy machine gun. I don't think I like the boost machine gun that much, to be honest. The gate's open now. Good. Let's go.
So your energy is kind of your health. You only have a little have a little health, but can't be killed if you have energy since being killed will just activate time stop. So your energy is kind of your health. Oh, okay. I see. Bruh, they are killing all of our troops. This is cancer. I cannot allow this to occur any longer. So messed up. The main gate is above you. You need to get up there and open it. Burns, I need some backup. Franklin, Rios, you two escort Sam. Everyone else, provide cover. I feel like I'm going to get them killed by accident this time. Are getting? I'm going to get them killed by accident. Oh no. Prepare to intercept enemy transports. Another heavy machine gun, it seems like. How convenient for these drone things to just move in a very predictable pattern. I am out of ammunition already. Great. How do I get down there so I could revive my boys? Structure. I need a bit more intel than that. Data analysis complete. It's highly probable we're looking at the Russian KNRB-0 Argus robot that's been at the center of the arms control debate. Bruh. Oh my god, it's Metal Gear Ray. I think I'm gonna need a bigger... <laughs> Oh my god, it is Metal Gear Ray. What the hell? It's a monocoque design. They sacrificed armor for payload capacity, so the outer shell should have some strength issues. I'd rather go all out than bother with defense. Time to hit hard and make him regret it. Uh. Oh shit. Am I? I am very dead, or I'm about to die anyway. This is the part that I think fe really feels like Metal Gear Revengeance. Or I'm assuming that they took that as, uh, Metal Gear Revengeance was inspired by, more or less. My troops here appear to all be equipped with rocket lawn chairs. Did we kill it? Is it dead? Oh my god! <laughs> yep, that's Platinum Games for you. I'm not even surprised. It transformed into a fucking tank. Are you shitting me right now? Bruh, it's a fucking mech it's a fucking mech warrior. Oh my shit.
Alright, I took out one of his arms, but he should have another arm, right? Bruh, quick time events? Oh my god, this is old. This is such an old tool game. Oh, god damn it. Can you see the core at the center of its torso? Yes, I see the core. Alright, that's one less arm. Are we supposed to be dodging those electrical things or what? Ah, uh, that was unexpected. Oh, he's firing nipple missiles. This is not Pog. Now I don't know what's going on, actually. Did I... Did we kill him? With a pistol, no less. This game is really over the top. Cover usage, 123%. Objective complete. Well done. If you say so. If you say so. Pissing in the wind. Let's go. Gladly. Yeah, no, we're kidding, right? Okay, so, uh... We're supposed to be changing weapons constantly, right? Because I feel like I've not seen another burst... Another burst rifle thing at all this whole game. Not since the very beginning. It kind of made me feel stupid for switching out the assault rifle to begin with. An EMP emitter? Cool. There is, there are graphic settings after all. And you set them to high. Let's do it. HDR is on. Level of detail is on. Motion blur is on. V-Sync is unnecessary. Okay. Let's do it. Wow. Saving, please don't turn off your computer. Well, I must say the graphics definitely look a lot sharper than they did earlier. It really looks pretty good on uh, normal settings, but this... Everything just sort of pops now. Still don't know what the hell I'm doing, but... I'm sure we'll get there, right? Nice. 
Not what I was after, but it'll do. It also feels like the game is moving faster now for some reason. The frame rate, I should say. Can we adapt that teleportation system to get around the colony? We're still working on that at DARPA. And you haven't tried it on humans yet? No, but when we did try it out, we had a rat literally had its head shoved up its ass. <laughs> Figures, that's the best you could do. Hey, it'll be at least three more years before we can get a human in that state. You're going to be rendezvousing with friendlies ahead. Sending over coordinates. Understood. Bravo, move out. Oh, a sniper rifle. I noticed that there are different colored guns. I'm assuming that's some sort of like, um... Some sort of a uh, rarity thing? Heavy machine gun. Every gun has a different outline, so it's not a rarity thing. It just happened to look cooler that way, okay. That guy sure took a long time to die, didn't he? Fucking really? Bruh, I just got knifed to death. What the shit? Get out of the way. I say get out of the way, you fucking idiot. God. Why am I dead now? Ah. God, I suck at shooting, hitting these things.
Bruh. Confusion. Confusion, confusion, confusion. What the fuck was that? That was weird. I might have to switch back down to normal difficulty because I don't understand this game well enough to play it at as is. Sorry, there's a lot of mechanics that they just threw you in the deep end for that I can't explain well via chat. It's fine, I'm just confused because it's I've never played a game like this before, like period. It's definitely, the gameplay definitely feels alien. I don't really, I've never was really into Gears of War and other cover shooters of this era. I kind of skipped this entire era of uh, third person shooter in fact. So I feel... It almost feels like I'm playing an FPS for the first time. Because I legit don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Even the whole uh, picking up a sniper rifle thing was mainly because I legitimately don't know how to play. So I'm just falling back to what I'm hoping is a familiar mode. Like just about anyone can just click on heads, right? Like, I can't help but feel like I'm playing this game incorrectly right now. Like, I'm supposed to be doing a lot more run-and-gun action or something. But, I don't know how to effectively... I don't know, um... Like, why the fuck did that happen just now? I could have sworn I did my melee button way before he did. If you want to do like a 10 minute VC session, I can explain the basics, but besides that, mostly experimentation. I guess we could do that another time. I was kind of hoping that this was just going to be a typical TPS with like some parkour mechanics or something in it. And boy howdy was I wrong. <laughs> I also kind of want to go back to the assault rifle now. Because that seems to be the most common weapon in the game. I've not seen a single burst rifle. Like. Since the start. Not burst rifle. Um, whatever that thing is. The uh, other. The other machine gun.
Wow, I sure feel dumb leaving my anti-armor pistol behind. <laughs> this music's also really hopping. This is very nostalgic for me. This sort of hyper techno music type thing. Shotgun. Wait, whoa. Remember that this is basically the first year this team has done and it was all action games? Oh. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. First and last, right? Platinum Games is not exactly known for their FPSs. They're mostly known for action games. Looks like it's time to be a big damn hero. How do I... I'm really starting to regret using the laser cannon now. Just how often it, I can't use it because of my energy reserves. Whoa, I didn't know you could do that. You know, I, think that shock treatment actually fixed my <laughs> I love the commentary in this game. Are you fucking serious? They really just... <laughs> I love the humor. The humor is great. This game is so corny. But I kind of figure that's by design, so... Oh my god, I'm out of ammo. I'm gonna be out of ammo soon. Thanks, sir. I didn't think anyone was coming for me. Thanks for the Finally, a gun I can actually kill people with. You save the others? Yeah, they're already free. They're lost. Those bindings felt great. What the fuck? Believe this. The gate is open. There should be an elevator on the other side. Go hear that. That's our ticket out. Head for the elevator. Are you fucking kidding me? I just dropped this. I feel uh, trying to fucking upgrade guns in this game is a nightmare, dude. Holy shit. Well, that's satisfying at least.
Well, so you're all right. You're supposed to drop the empty gun. Oh, so you're supposed to drop the empty guns. Okay, that's that's actual game. That's actual. That's part of the game design. See, that's why I was confused with the whole upgrading system. I was like, what's the point of upgrading guns in this game if you're just gonna be constantly dropping them anyway, unless all of them like stay upgraded along the course of it. This is not like this is not like fucking Borderlands or something where you modify the shit out of a gun and then you drop it for a different gun later on, right? That's because that's what my thought process was playing this. I was like, well, I mean, I want to hold on to the guns so I can upgrade them, right? But then I kept finding nothing but shotguns and assault rifles. And it's like, where the fuck is everything? <laughs> I can't run through this game just doing holding on to the same empty weapons forever because my melee attack is only this. And that has a cooldown. Okay, so that makes a lot more sense now. Alright, uh... I'll pop into VC. In the meanwhile, I don't really like shotguns, at least not in a game like this, so give me the HMG again. Rawr. Hey, that loser. How you doing? Sorry, Can I didn't you see. Me? Yeah, I see you. I hear you. I was just saying okay. hi to uh, another person in chat. So the the first thing is your health. You have like a Call of Duty bloody screen thing for health. Oh god. One but of those. If you if you have energy, when you would die instead you go into time slow. So if you keep at least a little bit of energy and don't overheat, you won't die. Bruh. So that's how the health that's how the health system works. You're functionally you immortal use, then. Okay. You want to use as much energy as possible without Completely expending it. Okay. And then the the thing with the guns is, um, when you pick up a duplicate of a gun you're holding, if the gun you're holding is missing any ammo, it'll refill your ammo. If if the gun you're holding is full, you'll get experience. So the optimal way to play is to completely empty guns and then swap. Once, you're, uh, once, the, once the gun you're holding is empty, you can either ditch it for another gun, or, um, like, if if you're in that one area where everyone dropped a bunch of assault rifles, yeah, you can you use the assault rifle to clear out everything, and then if there's, like, four assault rifles on the ground, the first one will fully replenish your ammo, and then the next three will give you experience towards leveling up the assault rifle. I see. That is not any sort... That's not the kind of game mechanics I would expect anyone to get. <laughs> no, it's totally it's, unintuitive. That's fucking convoluted as shit, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> and there's a, there's a trick with, like, swapping a gun, picking up a full version, and then picking up the version you just dropped to get experience, but that's not... It's not something you have to pay attention to. The main thing is just, like, you don't want to constantly be re-topping off your ammo. You want to empty your gun and then swap okay so you are supposed to be switching guns constantly throughout the course of this yeah all right it's that's so like the yeah the empty sniper rifle you were carrying around did nothing for you because if you picked up a sniper rifle it would refill your ammo but if you swapped guns and then swapped back to the sniper you would have a full sniper anyway <laughs> <laughs> makes sense Oh, hey, Lulz. Um, How you doing, me? I'm currently continuing my sleep deprivation because I don't fucking know. I'm a little quirky boy. Sorry, what are you saying, Steel? But yeah, that's that's basically it. If you follow that as, like, a guideline, you'll do fine. Um, the other thing is the laser gun because it's the only gun that works like that. Um, it's best used as, like, a sniper. Since it uses your energy, you want to be in cover when you're using it. It's not good for, like, sliding around and using... That makes sense. Oh, the special effects it does are great, though. Um, I think I I just picked up another heavy machine gun when my HMG was already full, and it looks like it's a it leveled up to a two or something. I don't know. So you'll collect chevrons when you pick up duplicates, and if you get enough, I think it's three, you'll get an upgrade. The stars are upgrades, the chevrons are experience. Okay. But a uh, an upgrade cube is the equivalent of a full level up. And this uh, follows you regardless of whether you're holding the gun already or not, I guess. Yeah. Oh, it does. <laughs> cool. 
<laughs> if you swapped off the laser gun, the next laser gun you picked up would have one level up. Oh. Well, you know what? That makes things so much easier. And then, um... The, this doesn't really matter, but it's, like, really confusing and has to do with item drops. But, like, when you die, your weapons will become unupgraded, but only once per checkpoint. And then it also, like, increases the drops of upgrade cubes after that happens. So, mm -hmm. like, it's a disincentivization for dying, but it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Yeah, it feels like the sort of thing that wouldn't be that big of a deal, wouldn't be that much of a problem until later on. Or unless you're, like, intentionally trying to min-max the game. Yeah, um, it, it really only matters when you've got, like, your favorite three guns. Um, because dying will make you net negative on upgrades. But, um, yeah, that's basically it. Um... And your grenades, you can swap between EMPs and frag grenades, and they upgrade the same way. You can't use cubes on them, but picking up grenades when you have full grenades will upgrade your grenades. Oh, yeah? Let's do that, then. Aha! Uh, this will come in handy. Yeah, <laughs> this will come in handy. Um, I actually forgot how to change grenade, how to switch grenades. <laughs> I forgot the entirety of the tutorial already. Oh. I don't know what it is on keyboard. I think it's four. Does four make you swap grenades? It is four, yep. Yeah. Okay. Um, oh yeah, that's pretty much it. Hog. Alright, cool. Thanks for the, uh, explaining all the hidden game mechanics. Or re-explaining yeah, them as well. Um, I want people to enjoy this game, but it's really hard to enjoy it if you don't understand what's going on. I mean, I kind of feel bad because I'm actually terrible at games like or I'm terrible. I'm terrible at those kind of games that you're supposed to like rack up combos and shit like they'll make me cry. And I was kind of afraid that this was pretty much going to be the same thing except as a third person shooter. Uh, I mean, kind of the score doesn't matter, but it does keep track of your score. The score I'm not too worried about. It's more like, um, I don't know. Yeah, whatever. This is so early in the game anyway. Let's continue. <laughs> uh, right. What is the point of these little golden statue things anyway? They're collectibles. They unlock stuff. Oh, so you're supposed to... You're supposed to just shoot them or...? Yeah, you shoot them to collect them and then they're just like... Intel or whatever from other games. That's cool. Yeah, once they're red, you've collected them. Cool. Uh, reverse cards, I'm alright. I'm trying out a... I'm trying out Vanquish before I play Metal Gear Revengeance sometime in the future. We need a break from Deus Ex, etc. Alright, I'll hop back in the chat. Alright, thank you. Bruh, the Russians look so much like the Covenant, it's not even funny. Trust is a weakness. Damn, man, we have a lot of troopers with us. Look at these be beefy motherfuckers. Oh, so that's how you activate the time stop. It's when you shoot. It's not a separate button you have to push. I'm making this too difficult on myself. I cannot fire my laser cannon. Bruh. Can you stop moving around? Holy shit. Oh no, James is dead. This is decidedly unpog.
Honestly, I'm surprised they named some of the random NPCs and they could actually, like, die and make you feel sad about it. You don't see that very often. Assault Rifle. Bruh. Is that portable cover? So it is. It's not portable cover, it's a fucking turret. Disgusting. Heavy machine gun. Stop shooting my fr- God damn it, stop moving in the front of my fucking bullets, I swear to God. Hey, when you do that. I like how he actually yells at them to get out of the way, though. Oh, for a moment there, I thought I was dead. Oh, sh you piece of shit. Or if you ADS while sliding, it'll activate as well. Yeah, that's a lot easier than some other games. I was overthinking it. Like I've been overthinking every, every other part of this game, to be honest. Retreat, you fools! Another assault rifle? Ooh, pretty gun! <laughs> oh, yes. Bruh! a very f interesting gun. Usually you see this sort of thing in the form of a multi-rocket multi launcher as opposed to just lasers. Stop being a cunt, Burns. Why am I getting the impression that Burns is actually the bad guy in this game? You know, it's just it's just a just a feeling. Uh fuck. Well there go all my upgrades, I guess. Since I'm dead now. Was that a rocket launcher just now? It was. Alright, so I'm supposed to go see a guy, right? Uh, oh boy, I think he is dead. Or something. 
I was not able to get, reach him in time, and now I feel like shit. Thank you very much, game. Those are grenades. Please get out of the way of the grenades. No? Okay, fine. You just want to sit there? That's fine, too. Damn it, George, we did not come back to save your ass, only for you to then yell, close the gate, leave me. Seriously. I like how even the uh, random NPCs that are running with or fighting with you also get a moment to shine. Oh shit! That better had not have been fucking George just then, or we're gonna be pissed. Uh, sure, bro. Just give me a kind of have a problem here. Yeah. Oh, that's where it's coming from. I'm getting cross fucking cross shots. God damn it. Laser cannon. The things I do to keep these assholes alive, I swear to God. <laughs> Get out of the way. Well done. You can pay me back later. This launcher. Sniper rifle. Heavy machine gun. I'll take this. What the fuck? So much for using that as cover. Oh, wow. Um, um, wow. 
10 10 tank design, my dudes. 10 10. Hello, Lilith. How you doing? You still screwing around down here? Up top is clean and clear. <laughs> Tough son of a bitch. Good. Glad to hear it. I'm getting my ass hand to me by this game right now. Duh, he do really be- oh shit! We're all a little goof. I'm getting my ass goofed, that's for sure. Shotgun. Disc launcher. Boost machine gun. Yeah, my heavy machine gun is no longer upgraded, unfortunately. Ayo, I, I think I found the uh, enemy's weak point already. Cool. Oh my god, that is a tank cannon. Oh, it's straight up a tank cannon. Oh. That was not nearly as difficult as I think it would have been. Otherwise, can you fuck off? Yeah, no shit. Three victory APCs heading for you. Uh, something we can rely on for once. Your DARPA rail guns are a piece of work, let me tell you. What fresh hell is this? <sighs> Someone blow that thing up. Sam, remember the high explosives equipped in the suit. Coming right up. Fire in the hole. You're safe to detonate now. Boom! Move on through! Darkness. I wonder how many acts there are in this game anyway. Oh my god. Is that ours? Oh yeah, we got ourselves this big ass real gun uh, thing. 
United States of America. And these are called Victory APCs? Why are the wheels spinning in the wrong direction? I'm getting some... I'm actually getting some uh, Earth Defense Force vibes from this level right now. The fuck is an LFE gun? Um, mm. Gun runner? I don't know what that is. Strange. Oh, spider mines. We'd love to see it. What the fuck? Take us all out. What about the tunnel? I don't know. Oh my god, no, what the shit, man? It's one of those games, isn't it? Don't you love escort missions? Yeah, I totally do. This is totally the game design of all time that we left back in the 90s. Yep. Totally love to see it back in this game. And nowadays, I think the our, I think we have decent enough AI where we could probably do an escort mission uh, fairly or just okay. But then again, who knows? I really should have taken that gun we found earlier. Something tells me it was made for this mission. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Pacel. Thank you for the Hydra Redeem. Long time no see. How have you been? Give me a second here to unfuck the current situation and then I will see to the hydrate redeem. This game is kind of this game is fucking over the top, I swear to god. There we go. Awesome. That's just great. Wow. Uh, usually work while you stream, but you got the day off. Oh, I'm glad to hear it. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> By the power of gamer subs. I have the power. He's got the touch too. All right, where was I?
Back to Vanquish. I'm curious as to why this game is named Vanquish anyway. I'm getting my ass vanquished, that's for damn sure. Ayo, it looks like our uh it looks like the APC has been revi has been revived to full health. There, finally. Jesus. Explosives are set. That's not going to be enough to take down the barricade. You need to place another set of charges. <clears throat> mm-hmm. That's exactly what I want to do. Place another set of charges. Yes, totally. I, I know, Elena. I know. I'm working on it. Please. You know what? Fuck it. Give me the shotgun. God damn it. I take it back. Give me back the sniper rifle. That shotgun's terrible in this game. is that that looks like an enemy APC enemy uh troop carrier why are they damaged I like that it has a distance, a uh, distance thing on it, which tells you basically how close you are to being screwed over. Great, more of them? Fucking seriously? Oh, that's just that's just wonderful. The disc launcher is next to useless, it feels like. I can't even see what I'm shooting at. Rocket launcher. Yes, perfect. One shot, one kill, one... Turns out the rocket launcher is goated. Okay, that was actually pretty cool just then. I can't believe I've died so many times that my upgrades for my laser cannon actually disappeared. 
I feel bad now. I fucking suck at this game. <laughs> but it's enjoyable. I hope y'all are also enjoying watching me suck at this game though. What now? Shove some tungsten up this tunnel's ass. Roger that. Whew. This colony won't be walking straight for a while. <laughs> Rocket launcher is awesome, but hard to upgrade because of ammo constraints. You're doing just fine, especially since you aren't a big shooter person. Also, hard difficulty. Yeah. I mean, I'm no longer a big shooter person. I haven't played a serious... Aside from, like, Shadowline, I haven't really played a serious shoot hand in a while, have I? That's just how it goes. I, I switched from being a big shoot... A, Big shoot end to a big fight end player now. The laser cannon is goated, I must say. Achievement unlocked, home run. Io. Yes, please shoot the damn thing, Mike Seven Six, because this is starting to get fucking annoying. <laughs> what did you shoot? Oh. Okay, you're shooting the robots. All right. You know what? That's acceptable. Huh? What do you mean? So what the fuck do you mean it's right below us? Oh, that's just... Oh! Oh, that's just lovely. What are the Russians cooking? I swear to God. Bruh. Did they just split our fucking railgun in half? Yes, they did. What the shit, man? That's kind of fucked up, not gonna lie. Oh my God. All right, Megatron. I just remembered that I can punch people. I cannot punch- it appears that I cannot punch the robot. This was a terrible idea. I'm gonna die. Heavy machine gun. Stop moving around so I can punch you. Jesus. There we go. Rocket lawn chair.
Now, where did I put the other rocket launcher? Around here, right? There it is. Wait, no, it's not. Um, I, I actually don't know where I put my old rocket launcher shit. It probably doesn't matter at this point. If you drop an empty gun at these... God damn it. <laughs> so much for that, I guess. I think I'm sexually attracted to my laser gun. You would be too if you understood what this thing meant to me. God damn it. Rocket lawn chair. Who goes there? Thank you for the... Thank you for the bits. Show us how you use the big cannon. I'll show you a big cannon. <laughs> Io, check it out. An upgrade for my rocket lawn chair. Shut the fuck up, Sam. We stand... Upgraded... We stand the upgrade uh, rocket lawn chair. Uh, should I bring the LFE? I don't fucking know what the LFE gun even does. Ooh, another HME. I'm still mildly angry that they we went to all the trouble to keep that fucking railgun in one piece, and what happens? It gets destroyed. Gee, thanks for nothing, game. Whiskey a go go, baby. Did they just stop? Did they? Did they not bother naming any of our men anymore? What happened? Not sure. Incidentally, the other lift appears to be in motion. Oh. Oh, here they come. What's happening over here? Oh! Oh boy. Oh, he's dead, okay. Bruh. That's a real human being there. Professor Candide? Professor? No doubt about it. Sam, you have to help him. I know, but I'm kind of busy right now. The fuck is he doing here? Get out of the way. Oh. 
Good thing he doesn't take friendly fire. Because I do not have the patience for it right now. Uh-oh. Bruh. Just look at that cod piece, holy shit. <laughs> Point blank rage with the rocket launcher and oh shit. It's not a quick time event. Rip. You need practice. Why don't you rub it in? Why don't you? Bogey. One epic name. I don't know what's happening, but it doesn't look good. Bruh. So am I dead or... Oh, fucking shit. Oh, it actually did damage to him. Cool. No, it didn't. It did not. It completely fucking missed. I guess that makes sense. Why would he let you hit them with the fucking strongest gun in the game? Bro, really? Did you really just do that? Really wish I had my sniper rifle now. Thankfully, there's like no bullet drop on these guns, so... That shit just hurts. Anti-armor pistol. Did I just shoot him out of the sky? I did! What the fuck? I just put Oh my god, he's pissed. This boss fight's kind of fun despite being so frustrating. Oh my god. It's like in... Oh my god, it is. It is. <laughs> Falcon Punch! <laughs> that really just happened. <laughs>
Klaus für Dania. Space Normandy. Operation Overlord 2. What does that mean? Why didn't you tell me about the professor? It didn't come up. So this is a rescue mission for you two? My orders are classified. Not when we're on the lines together. I need to know everything you know. Elena and I do not fall under military jurisdiction, Lieutenant Colonel. I think what you're trying to say is fuck off. Hacking now. Hacking now. The lines in this game are great. Very corny, very over the top. Just the way I like it. This laser cannon is so obnoxiously large. Alright, it's time to try out the LF Gion. Fuck it. Who goes there? Silvis, thank you so much for the raid for the Party 15. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the Lol's Time Show with your host Lawler Hicks, the shit poster AI who is currently playing a game a ancient game about vanquishing foes called Vanquish. Who thank Spirit of the Eric, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the Lol's Time Show. How is everyone this evening? What are you guys playing? You're playing Ash of Gods The Way. I've never heard of that, but it sounds like it was an interesting stream. It's been a long time. Welcome, 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 welcome. Greetings and goddess blessings to you all. Thank you very much for your greeting. May the Omnissiah bless you in return. It's incredible. It's incredible. Is there a lot of reading involved? An incredible reading? Uh, give me a second here. I still have not mastered how to play this game properly. So you will unfortunately be subjected to the most cringiest of gameplays. That does not look like it did what I wanted it to do. I think this is an explosive energy gun thing. Oh yeah, that was that was moist. Actually, that, ju that just now was very moist. One second. Okay, so I was saying... Uh, it's a mix of card game, tactics RPG, and visual novel. Very nice character writing. Really? Those are certainly things that go well together, I must say. I'll have to check that game out sometime, myself sometime. Up. Oh my god. This game is kind of frustrating from time to time. Uh, well, if I could just get some room to breathe, that would be nice. But unfortunately, that doesn't seem like it's going to be happening anytime soon. That didn't do much, did it? Oh my fucking god, what are these things? One second, I need to save my friend here. Uh, okay, just, can I get a moment to breathe, please? Can you guys, can these robot things fuck off? Alright, as I was saying, highly recommended. I had a blast and not too long of a game. I love the world, even if this is a more grand... 
if this is more grounded of the Ash of Gods games. So this is the latest in a sequ latest in a sequence of games then. Interesting. <laughs> Another rocket launch here. Ah, uh, yes. Hello, the world. I'll be sure to check it out, but it does sound like a really interesting RPG, that's for sure. They, there are, there are two. They are loosely connected, but they share a world. I see. I see. It's been a while since I played a decent, um, since I played a decent. Uh, fantasy RPG, honestly. The last one I played on stream was probably For the King. And that was a fairly long time ago now. So I'll be sure to check it out. But you don't need to play one to enjoy the others? Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> I was just telling chat that people want me to play Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. And I was thinking if I had to play through all the other Metal Gear games before I play Revengeance. The art is also very Banner Saga-esque. Ooh. That's always a plus, isn't it? Indie series? Indie game? Here's a good example. You have three assault rifles. Even if you swap to a different gun, that's two free XP and you can just change guns. Uh, I don't see any... Oh, and then you could change guns. That's what you meant. Okay. Certainly indie. Okay. <laughs> you know I love covering indie games on this channel. I'll be sure to find some time to make or find some time to play the or check them out. Thank you for the recommendation. <laughs> All right, let's do a chat. Once more into the breach, it seems. Where's the freight transport? The room is on the other side of that door. You want to take the stairs in there up a level. Headed there now. Thank you. <laughs> Have a good night, and thank you for bringing your chat over. Always appreciate that. Do do do. Are you fucking kidding me right now? So there's another sniper rifle here I could have just grabbed. Maybe we don't need to? I guess I can't go back the way I came anyway, so we'll just have to press on forward. You all two- oh, you two know each other? Fairy Pog. Ah! I love the laser gun. The laser gun is probably the only gun that I won't swap out ever. Because it is immensely useful. It continues to be immensely useful anyway. I really wish you could jump in this game. Wouldn't that be nice? Didn't I just kill this person? Bruh. If you don't fucking die in two seconds. Yes. Awesome. That was actually kind of cool. I just wasted a rocket launcher on this fucking mook. I am... I am apoplectic right now. Uh. So much for my upgrades. You had shotgun... Equipped the whole game? I can't handle shotgun. I don't want... I would have to stick... And people's faces to use it. I feel like, oh, another laser cannon. This game loves me.
Another rocket launcher. Ayo. <laughs> oh, pog. Oh, that is not a robot. That is... That was definitely... Oh my fucking god. This map is hell. That is a, definitely a staircase of all time, Elena. Thank you very much for this information. I'm glad to know that that is in fact a fucking staircase. I'd even say it's a staircase of all time. Bruh. Seriously? The fuck was that shit? Are you kidding me right now? Oh my god! There are quick time events here that can kill you. Okay. I see how it is. Megatron. <laughs> uh, I will never tire of commandeering vehicles in this game. Oh god, audio is kill? How so? The game audio is tearing apart? Oh shit. No! Fuck! That would be a horrible way to die just then. Oh, it's back? <laughs> That's good to hear. Enemy RI closing in from behind your position. Let's go, Bravo. Get to the back of this thing. Home run. God, apparently. Oh. 
I like the variety of mission types in this game. It's very nostalgic. I would like to know how the Russians commandeered a giant space station like this, or if they already owned it to begin with. There's a whole... There's a below, below us? Fucking Out fucking standing. It's kind of hard to read the signage though when I'm busy trying to defend myself. I'm surprised it's not written in Rus Russian. So I could only assume this used to be some sort of international space station before it was commandeered by the Russians. Then again, much of this game doesn't really make sense, so maybe I'm thinking too deeply into it. I'm out of ammunition already? Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. There's something on that ship that I don't want to reach here. And it does not. That's a good way to put it, I suppose. Rocket lawn chair. Heavy machine gun. If you continue on your present course, you'll enter Heavy machine gun. Jesus, this is annoying. I wonder if this is timed. Like, you only have a set number amount of time to kill these things before the collision happens. Uh, um, oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, my fucking God. Oh, my fucking God. Oh, my God. This is so fucking cool. <laughs> That's actually really fucking cool. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I didn't expect the fucking game to just make it so that you have to like shoot them above you now. Sixty seconds until what? Until what? Oh. Uh, oh, for fuck's sake, game. Really? To Elena, for fuck's sake, I'm doing my best.
All right, all right, I fucking shit, I got it. God damn. It was timed. What the fuck do you mean the track is damaged? What? 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 Oh god, the track's derailing. The propulsion systems were destroyed by that hit. It's too quiet. No sign of enemy units in the area. Stay frosty. I want you ready to shoot if you see so much as a fucking Roomba. You call <laughs> Roomba? <laughs> the call's in, but it's gonna take some time. You think they'd come running for a little bird like you, Burns? The TLDR is it's a global communal space station, but Russians hijacked just a solar power generator and are using it as a WMD. Actually, that's not TLDR, that's the extent of the plot the game pretends to have. <laughs> I see. And you know what? It works just fine. You've got enemies approaching dead ahead. For a game like this, I don't think you need much in the way of of story anyway. Yeah, about that. Oh my fucking god. Okay, fine. Uh, you said it, buddy. There are enemies in every building. For fucking... What do you mean you're out of ex... Out of fucking... Out of... Ah... Uh... The assault rifle continues to be based... I think we still got these turrets. Damn. RPG where? Bad news. Large troop transport inbound. You're not kidding. That is a very bad news. Everywhere. Everywhere? That's not what I want to hear, Elena. Give me good news. Are you fucking with me right now, game? How do you expect me to defend against this shit? Or maybe that's the point, you're not supposed to be able to. Oh my god, yes. 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 <laughs> god damn it, game. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Your last year's model. <laughs> Elena, take control of this thing. Whenever you're ready, Sam. Uh oh. We'll be fine. Keep moving forward. Hold on. Coming after you. Uh Wow. Oh no. 
Yeah, I don't know if he's gonna survive that, man. That's good to know, Elena. <laughs> We're not taking responsibility if you end up KIA, sir. I don't expect you to. Now, where's the fight? Up, oh, there's the fight. That ended up working out nicely. Achievement. Whatever that means. We ended up taking out all the enemies on that transfer without losing any of these guys here. That's cool. Holy shit. I, uh... Oh, wait. Never mind. <laughs> Well, that was fun. Well, that wasn't very much fun. <laughs> I'm increasing velocity. Got it. That's probably the only time in this entire game where I didn't die violently in some manner. Oh, hell, it's you again. I've already killed one of these assholes before. Oh, he'll be fine. He's had worse, right? Well, at least you're alive. Hey, hey, not so loud. I already feel like a drum course beating on my skull. Those are some fat cigarettes. Where do I need to go? You're going to have to head to the airport. I'm sure our robot friend will be happy to see me again. Sorry, I don't see any way around it. And off I go. <sighs> oh, we got a twi- You managed to clip that, huh? I need more clips, honestly. Let's watch it, though. I want to watch the exact thing that you clipped. Oh, thank you. How long is this game? I feel like I'm going through it at a fairly fast pace. It feels like a, I feel like I'm playing an arcade game. 
or something that was slated originally as an arcade game. Act 2, Mission 3? Wait, when did we get into Act 2 already? Holy shit. Bruh. F fucking seriously? Rocket launcher. That's a platinum model though. It's not a long game, especially if you're not interested in replay value. That's the platinum model though. Hmm. I wonder if I should try being this game tonight then. Then again, it is past midnight already. Oh my god. What the fuck was that? Thanks for the update, Admiral. Yeah, thank. Yes, thanks for thanks a lot for the heads up, Elena. Did I just kill myself? I think I did. It is short, but not one stream short. That's good to know. I'm wondering if I should check out now or nah. We'll go to we'll play to three hours, chat. I forgot, this gun doesn't work without energy. That's trying to get kind of annoying. It's a trap. Thanks for the update, Admiral. They're jamming me again. You'll have to get rid of the RIs first. Seriously? Extra fuck you to you two. I'll take this. Jeez, that took way too long. I'm into the system. Are we going to do some quick time events again? Bruh. <laughs> Two of 
them this time. They must think I like punishment. They heard you're a masochist, Sam. Bruh, he's still alive. <laughs> Miss me, sweetheart. Jesus, you? I liked you better when I thought you were dead. I liked you better when I didn't have to hear your shit. Let's go. Hogger up. Oh, what the shit? LFG gun. Bruh. 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 Such game design. Very fair and balanced. Okay. Hog. Oh my god. <sighs> Lock on laser. Good thing this thing is ne nearly indestructible, more or less. Except when he's stamping all over it, of course.
Or that. Christian, thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing today? I am getting my ass kicked, as usual. God damn it. The division, huh? Very nice. How is that? <laughs> Bitch, if you don't die yet, I'm going to fucking rage. At least I got one of these assholes. Oh, we're going to do a quick time event now. Is that what's going on? Oh my god. So I got some revenge and shit going on here. Yes. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was definitely something that was recycled from Metal Gear. <laughs> Oh yes, yeah, good old Vanquish. It was cool. Good of farm and the global event. Love this game. I'm glad you do. I'm getting used to it. It's this is my only the second time I play a platinum game. The last one being near Automito, and I didn't. I still don't know what the hell I'm doing, but it's it's fun. So far, I think I'm. I think I'm having fun anyway. <laughs> So which one of these things am I supposed to be aiming for? That thing? The Argus back? Oh, he is pissed. He does not appreciate me shooting him, chat. Unfortunately, I don't think he has a choice in the matter, does he? Oh, he's firing his laser cannon. In retrospect, this is pretty much all Revengeance is, right? Just one big boss battle after another. Against seemingly impossible odds. So I should probably get, learn to get good. Saw that coming a mile away. Another rocket launch chair chap. Don't mind if I do, but I don't think it's very useful against these particular enemies. Ayo? I blew up one of his arms? Are we doing another quick time event? Pog? Oh my god, this is the famous part in the trailer where you punch him in the face. Oh, are we going to make it? Yes. I love how you just get to keep punching it. Show you again. <laughs> oh my god, that really just happened, huh? No, of all the times to run out of ammunition, why did it have to be now? Why am I out of ammo, chat? God damn it. I wonder if this thing can still fight me being unable to see. Oh, it doesn't need to see. It just has to fire all the fucking missiles. I see how it is. It reminds me of Spec Ops The Line, a product of its time in defiance of the genre standards. You know, that's a good way to put it, I would say. I shall need to head to bed here in a hornacy late. May the gods bless all of you and may you enjoy the rest of the stream. 
Thank you, Silvis. You have a good night. Thank you for bringing your chat over. Much appreciates. Ah! I'm literally out of ammunition. Oh, man. This game really knows what I like, doesn't it? Uh, did he just kick Colonel Burns? What a bastard. No, I did... Fucking kicking me in the... That's so... Unprofessional. I think he just took out the last uh, flying friend that was helping us distract him. That's unfortunate. I wasn't able to save them in time from themselves. Oh yeah, that's never explained. If you get hit by a fire EMP attack, it will drain your energy. You can tell by Sam being on fire. Compared to a normal out of energy aura. <laughs> Imagine explain, explaining the game. I see that the disc thrower is functionally useless against the- oh wait, nope. Oh, hey, the uh, our- the uh, air, our um- the air marine- the marines that were helping us earlier were actually able to do something. And Mr. Burns here is firing a fucking charged plasma shot from, uh, from, uh, Metroid. Ow. Oh my god. So is this dude dead yet? What the fuck? You just do not want to die, do you? Alright, okay, can we finally finish this thing off? It's literally a paraplegic at this point. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. Okay, finally it's dead. Jesus. My man required my man needed me to do surgery on it. Ah. <sighs> Stationed on the colony are setting up a base in the central building. Meaning there are remaining colony forces? Communications were cut off before they were able to confirm any survivors. Should we go and check it out? We don't have time to be checking things out. If there are survivors, they might have intelligence on enemy positions. And any information on enemy locations is better than what we know right now. Trying to convince me it's worth it, huh? 
Great Fox Field Ops will be providing intel support, sir. I'm unlocking the door. Proceed through to the other side. All right, Bravo. Move out. <laughs> Heavy machine gun. Where's the where's the other machine gun? A large bore HMG with impressive oral firepower and rate of fire. This weapon is limited by its magazine capacity. So the boost machine gun is just a stronger heavy machine gun. Well, have a night night, Christian. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go to actually beside him. It has been three hours so far. And it's way past 12. I gotta go. I got to head to bed. But thank you to everyone who stopped by tonight, especially those who came with a raid. Always appreciated. Let's go find someone to raid tonight as well to return to spread the love. The question is who? I know who or just just who we're raiding actually. It's been a while since I've seen my online. Thank you. What should be our raid message tonight? Yeah, I think. Memes from above. Hi, here we go. Here's what we'll raid with, chat. Wow, we actually have 15 still around? I didn't realize that you all enjoyed my Vanquish ASMR as well as you did. Well, thank you very much for everyone for stop for sticking around for a little bit longer. I do stream Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, although this week is kind of unscheduled. We're just kind of doing whatever the hell. We'll probably be streaming again on Friday. I haven't decided yet, but if I do pop on, you'll see me here. If you would like to see more of my content, quote unquote, feel free to drop me a follow. I would greatly appreciate it. No problem to crow. Thank you for always coming around. Appreciate it. I appreciate it lots. Uh, when Street Fighter 6 gets released on beta, which is soon, like in a couple days, we're going to be playing that mostly. So look forward to that. Have a good night, everyone. <laughs>